Welcome to Futera TV. I'm um, joined by Rory Fallon, the man himself, New okay. Zealand legend, or more known as it is at the moment. So that you're, you're ecstatic with the proceedings over the last few months. You've taken New Zealand to the World Cup. Yeah. How are you feeling? Uh, just at the moment, like just buzzing out really over the uh, you know going to a World Cup as it's you know it's a massive massive achievement for New Zealand, but most of all you know a personal achievement for me. Uh, you know it's the pinnacle of anyone's any footballer's uh, life. So. No, I'm going to really enjoy it. Cool. So, I mean, I'm not a footballer. You probably can tell. Uh, I, I, we, we were talking about this earlier. When that ball came over to you, I don't, I don't know if you just go into autopilot or, or what goes through your mind. In a big game like that, the ball comes to you, you know, if I stick this one in the net, I could be taking my team to the World Cup Finals. What, what, goes, what goes through your mind? Uh, nothing goes through your mind, really. It's, um, you know, from training. You learn it from, from training. So the more you, uh, hard work you put in training, uh, the more things like that come off for you. Uh, so, right. you know, it's um, just uh, training your body to know, you know, where to put the ball. And, you know, uh, it was a great cross and all I needed to do was guide into the goal, really. What's your greatest football memory? What's the, what's the highlight for you of your career so far? I'd have to say uh, the barring game. That's, you know, just uh, the pressure on that goal, you know, the pressure on the game, um, you know, is the bit, you know, the most pressurised game I've been in uh, when you knew that you're 90 minutes away from the World Cup and you know the whole of New Zealand and the world are watching you and um, you know there was an enormous amount of pressure on everyone so I think that one. As a, as a child did you always want to be a footballer? Was it one of Rory Collins like did you just expect to be a footballer or do you know from a young age you know what I mean? Yeah I knew from a young age um, you know my dad was a coach um, you know I was born in '82. That's the year they went to the World Cup. Oh, right. So I was brought up in all that. Yeah, yeah. it's a strange one. Um, I was brought up in all, you know, all the World Cup stuff. I uh, can't remember it like. But, um, and then my then my dad coached my brother, who ended up going to uh, Liverpool for three years. And uh, I wanted to always be better than my brother. Right. So uh, that was, you know, it was just uh, one of them things a boy would dream. What are the pros? And the cons of being a professional footballer, what are the ups and downs? Uh, the ups are, uh, you know, getting goals like that and getting deals and, you know, um, just really enjoying your football and, you know, everything, you know, everything is just brilliant. Um, the downs are getting injured, uh, not playing, you know, loss of form, um, you know, and then that, you know, you start playing in the reserves and, you go to undesirable places that you don't really want to be playing, but you have to to try and get back in the first team. You know, these things are hard, and you know, probably the worst is injury because there's nothing you can really do about it. What are your top three goals that you've ever scored? Uh, I'd have to say bicycle kick against uh, Bristol City when I was playing for Swindon. Um, another bicycle kick uh, versus Barnsley in the playoff final when I was playing for Swansea. Talk us through that one. Do you remember? Or was it a bit of a bit of a blow? I remember that one. Uh, it was a free kick. Uh, someone hit it up into the air, and I just it just went up above my head, and I just thought, oh, this is this is a nice time for me to you know try and hit it as high as it can because once it comes down lower, you know that someone's going to hit it. So I thought I'd hit it as highest point, uh, hit it, and it went in the corner, and you know, there was about sixty thousand people in the stadium, so it erupted, and you know, that was a good goal. Yeah. And um, just recently against Barnsley, a, a, a 35-yarder uh, playing for Plymouth. Talking of great goals, what's the best one you've ever seen? Uh, I'd probably say, you know, I'm a big fan of Diego Maradona. Uh, so his probably 86 World Cup when he um, went through all the uh, English team in the quarterfinals. Good stuff. So you've got a team on the website then. Yeah. It's the team name? Uh, Rory Fallon FC. Rory Fallon FC. Now to take me on. Rory Fallon FC. <laughs> Not a bad team. Yeah, um, I, I could do with a cut. I could do with a little left back and well, a right winger. It's funny you should say this because um, before we were talking about this, and you've got quite a good little team there. To be fair, because my team's still in town on there. I think I've got just got a load of Everton rejects. <laughs> so you know, I don't know where you've it, you, you've got it. So what? What? Who's, who's your who's your best player for the team? Uh, my best player is probably at the back. It's probably Bobby Moore. Bobby Moore. Uh, um, my yeah. best midfielder is probably either Perlo. Or Christian Ronaldo, and uh, my front two is me and uh, Van Basten. You got yourself, so it's, yeah. Mind you, you're a, you're a hero on the game. I, I think so, yeah, hero. I think so. Nice work. So me and Basten, me and Van Basten up front, so it's not a bad pairing. Yeah, Score a few goals. So cool. Well, I'm sure that the guys that play the game will 
will be will be looking for you now. So uh, yeah, I hope you brushed up on your skills, Rory. Really, to be fair, I'm going to be gunning for you. <laughs> yeah, they won't be gunning after me now because I've been quite uh, you know I've been under the spotlight, but now yeah. I'm, uh, now they know who I am. Uh, they'll be uh, gunning gunning to beat me. I think. Thanks for coming to see us, see us today. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. Cheers, Good man. luck uh, for the World Cup. Yeah. And it uh, Rory for life. <laughs>